Hey everyone, I'm Barnyard from Half Cocked, and today the first official trailer for the Breaking Bad Netflix movie El Camino has dropped. Uh, this movie is coming out fairly soon, uh, October 11th, only about two weeks away. Uh, they have been releasing some tr uh, teaser trailers, you know, a couple one minute clips. Uh, they first dropped one, what, back in August, and then, then one earlier this week. Uh, but this is the first official trailer, uh, 2 minutes, 17 seconds. So, yeah, let's react to it. His face is all messed up with scars. Oh, that's the way. Looks defeated. Badger. I saw my face in me, and I know I've changed. Though I love much the same. I found grace in black water in my soul Tell my heart I told you so Okay, so that really hasn't told us too much about the movie. Uh, now, it does seem like an extended teaser at this point. Uh, you know, they don't really give you much about the story, and I like that. You know, it keeps us uh, in suspense on what the movie is actually going to be about. Um, now obviously, from what you can tell, Jesse, he's on the run. He... Uh, He's wanted by the law because, you know, he escaped the uh, the white supremacist compound. And obviously he was Hank Schrader's last leading uh, suspect into his Heisenberg case before he was killed. Um, so, yeah, it looks like he's just on the run. Um, there was a scene with someone digging in the desert. I don't know if he's looking for the rest of Walt's money or... Or what, because we don't know what happened to the rest of his money, uh, because the white supremacists are dicks. Uh, see some familiar faces in here, Badger and Skinny Pete. See a photo of Andrew and Brock, so he's probably still devastated about that. Um, there's about 14 seconds left, let's see what that... Uh, nothing, okay. Um... Sorry, I just I saw there was extended time, thought there was something else. Uh, but this, I mean, I'm excited. It looks like Breaking Bad. It looks like Breaking Bad on a much larger budget. Uh, some of the scenes in this trailer uh, were very similar to scenes in Breaking Bad. Like, they had the, uh, the landscape shot with time passing over. They had that over in Albuquerque Street. Um... It very it feels very familiar to Breaking Bad, which is is very very good, for, um, much needed positive. Because I know there's some people that are worried about this movie, that thinking that they should have just left it at season five, you know, at, uh, with Walter dying and Jesse on the run, not knowing what he's doing, an ambiguous ending. But I kind of like them showing what's going to happen to Jesse. Uh, hopefully, he gets some answers or find something that he needs 
it's like I say, man, this trailer didn't give us too much. Uh, I'm really looking forward to this movie. I'm a big Breaking Bad fan. As soon as I heard that El Camino was dropping on Netflix in October, I went ahead and already rewatched the entire series of Breaking Bad. Um, I want to watch Better Call Saul. I just haven't gotten around to it yet. And uh, yeah, man, this looks good. And I'm very excited for it. October 11th. I've already made plans to watch it with my mom because I got her hooked into Breaking Bad as well. Uh, but yeah, man. I'll definitely be doing a review for that. So don't, you know, d definitely don't worry about that. Um, if you are worried. Uh, but yeah, man, uh, this has been my initial reaction to the f extended teaser trailer, I'm going to call it, for El Camino, a Breaking Bad movie. Uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel with uh, more content like this. I'm going to get back into trailer reactions. Um, also, after credits, my main show where I review movies. I am working on my stockpile right now. I am going to be reviewing, reviewing movies that have come out this previous summer. You know, the big blockbuster movies that I uh, was unable to do at the time of the release. So I will be catching up. October, I plan on doing some spooky movies for reviews. Probably some throwbacks, uh, you know, for Halloween. But yeah, uh, definitely going to try to keep it to at least Saturday for after credits. Um, that's my initial plan. Just every Saturday release a trailer, or not a trailer, but a uh, movie review. Um, I am planning on getting back into streaming. I know I don't have too many people that are watching my streams right now, and that's okay. Um, October 25th is when the new Modern Warfare comes out. I, uh, that is the day before my birthday, and I'm really looking forward to play that. So I will probably be streaming Modern Warfare, the, uh, the campaign, on my YouTube channel. And then I haven't decided if I want to go to Twitch or Mixer. Because I have a lot of games on my Xbox uh, that, you know, on my Xbox I can't stream on YouTube, but I can stream on Mixer and Twitch. So I haven't decided on which platform I'm going to use. I have, I have accounts on both. Uh, so if you have any preference, and you, if you have any preference on which one I might like better, uh, comment down below and tell me what you thought, or tell me what you think about each platform. Uh, but yeah, leave a like down below, comment down below, tell me what you thought about this trailer, there we go, and, uh, tell me if you're excited for the Breaking Bad movie, um, and yeah, anyway, you guys have a great rest of your Tuesday, I'll see you soon, peace.